uh, hi guys have a happy day uh, in this video we are going to see about uh, choosing an image or document from our gallery so first thing firstly we need to note few things about uh, before implementing the first thing is react native document picker and react native file system we are going to use these two packages uh, let me show the two things uh, before that this is the continuation of last session the last session we are going to be seen about opening camera or opening video so in the in this session we are going to see about opening gallery uh, before that we need to know what is document picker uh, so if you guys need to know about uh, opening camera or opening video you just go through these things react native implementation with image picker i have uh, given this link in bio so firstly we are going to see about react native document picker this react native document picker helps to directly taken uh, image or document from our gallery firstly the size of an uh, this npm is very less it compared to the other thing and then weekly downloads also this is the majorly document mostly using in react native so in this thing we are having a lot of props as we seen earlier so we can able to choose uh, all types we can able to pick only image we can able to pick only audio only pdf only zip CS, css etc okay uh, let's and then the react native file system uh, the uses of react native file system is to use or convert after getting a document we need to convert that to base 64 for converting this base 64 process we used react native file system let's dive into implementation i have used the same thing as previously what we used i just added a few things in that uh, in below we used a few things for camera and video i have added for gallery this is the function so in this function i used to try try catch to avoid this uh, crashing the server so here we can able to see the document picker the document picker i have uh, imported from react native document picker so here i just used pick single there are few things are there we can pick multiple also for neat and clear cut i just used a single thing uh, for document picker dot here the type so as i seen uh, earlier we can give a number of times currently i'm just allowing all the types so after take and uh, selected a picture or type or document we can able to get that uh, last final object from picked file so after that so let me show a demo first then we can go with the conclusion so this is the thing i'm just clicking a gallery it's directly taken us to the gallery uh, here it will give an option like you can choose from drive our phone gallery currently i'm using downloads so in this downloads i can able to see only one image so i'm just selecting an image so see here after selecting an image currently it's showing base 64 base 64 is this so let me show console for you it will be easy to understand okay again i'm just choosing see here we can able to see the picked file and the picked file this is the few things <coughs> they have given like the uri size name and type so these are the few things we needed for converting these things to base 64 we need react native file system so i just taken from this react native file system rnfs dot read file of you need to give a uri you have taken from the picked file so after that i'm just giving the format to be converted base 64 once that's done it's giving a base 64 data this is the base 64 data uh, if you guys need to store it in cloud or aws bucket s3 bucket anything you can you need to use base 64 format so this is the simple format i have used here uh, so here we can able to access camera access video access gallery so when i'm clicking camera i can able to access camera able to capture a picture video gallery so when you are when if you are using these things uh, while opening while clicking and file itself you just uh, allow to use these three options camera video or gallery 
other people can easily access and use it if you guys need to use multiple thing like multiple file upload file types all those things you can refer this react native file system documentation it will be helpful for you hope you guys have useful time uh, thank you guys if you guys need any support please uh, ping in comments uh, definitely i will try to uh, resolve that thank you guys bye bye